There it is. You could watch the grass grow all day long and you wouldn't see a thing. You wouldn't see a thing. Kind of like looking in the mirror. Have any of you ever looked at yourself and watched you grow? It happens too slow. But if you left on vacation, nobody cut the grass for a whole month. When you came back, would you see that the grass has grown? Oh, yeah. Yes. yes. So now you know what I'm looking at. You guys have grown so much, this is fast you're getting better. Today was one of the fun days because you actually could see the improvements. A lot of times I see improvements, but you can't see them. Maybe a couple days ago you got the ball and were afraid to drive. So you didn't lose it. You thought, okay, good, I didn't lose it. I'm thinking to myself, go for it. So then today you listen to the coach and you got it and you go for it and then you got it stolen from you. And you might be like, oh, this coach, why would he tell me to do that? To me, that's a huge improvement. You're gonna get frustrated. You're gonna wanna make excuses. You're gonna wanna blame other people. You're gonna wanna quit, but the great people don't. They stick with it if it's worth doing. I'm sure a couple of you felt that way. Heck, some of you didn't know the rules. You didn't know double dribble. You couldn't make a shot. And now, that was real basketball. Now, Chad's making jumpers. Now, Gio's going coast to coast for an and one to win the game without double dribbling. Maximo always dominates. The guy's a beast. Let me say this. This is a special need. Usually, we... it ain't up to me. You know what you're going to get from me. It's up to you. Would you guys like to be a part of the best league ever? Yeah. 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 Would you like to be a part of something so incredible that when kids come here in 10 years or 20 years, all they try and do is as good as you? Wouldn't that be neat? Does that sound like something you want? Yeah. Well, everybody wants. Everybody wants. Everybody wants. They want, they want, they want, they want. Gimme, 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 gimme. You think if wanting it was enough? You gotta take it. You gotta practice at home. Come to training. You wanna get better? Teddy, what's the secret? The secret is you never stop getting better. I've never seen a group of kids improve the way you have so far. Hopefully I'm not making a mistake giving you a compliment. Sometimes when you give kids or adults compliment, they get complacent. It means, um, here's an example of complacent. Let's say I have one test left to go for the year. I have 100% in the class. I could get a zero on the last test, and because I did so good all year long, that zero, I would still get an A. Some people would get complacent and stop doing the study. They would stop doing the things that got to them to 100%. They get complacent, they get lazy. Some people would call that being a loser. If you didn't do your best and got 100, I wouldn't be happy. If you did your absolute best and got a 70, I'd be thrilled. But I need you to do your best, not just here, the entire week. And then when the season's done, the entire off season. Don't, if you want something, you are in charge of getting it. Jackson, if you don't get good enough at basketball to go play in college or to win in college or to play in the pros, is it my fault? Whose fault is it? You're not too young to tell that to. Neither are college kids, neither are pro players. Do you understand? Yes. I think you can do more. I think you have more in the tank. I believe that. But it doesn't matter what I believe. It matters what you do. Awesome job. I'm very, very happy with you but not so happy that you gotta stop getting better. We understand each other? Yeah. Awesome job, awesome job. Picture, picture you guys. Picture you guys. Yeah.